Alrighty boys, so I've had this plan pretty much over here. I got this little tiny crappy bike that I've had back here for, I don't know, forever. I've had this plan ever since I did this. Oh, there. To, uh, well, yeah, basically do exactly what I did there. Same scenario, same everything. Start at the top of the hill, roll all the way down and launch off the dock. But this time, instead of just driving off of it, have like a giant freaking FMX ramp or some crap and just launch. Maybe do a freaking double backflip or something. I don't know. Yeah, here you go. That one actually has a chain on it, so it's useless. This one, however, has no chain on it, no brakes on it. It's just, I mean, like, look, it's all rusted out. It's basically scrap metal. So I'm going to launch this thing off the dock and yeah that's really all the thinking I've put into it so luckily I don't think I'm gonna have to go and buy wood to make this thing here's a picture this is my plan make it something like that and then I can just literally bolt it in to the dock so whenever i launch off it didn't go anywhere so i got this big old scrap pile of wood can't really use any of this yeah but i have pretty much some two by fours i can utilize a bunch of plywood i'm thinking i'm just gonna use this oh you know it doesn't have to be anything wide just get this thing and uh well That doesn't sound very good, but and just bend it at an angle about right like that. And if I hit this at about Mach 2, I'm pretty sure that I will literally sky across the entire pond, maybe land on the other side. Heck, I don't know. So, yeah, that's like the flooring part of it, that part. And then to make the part that's actually it's going to be sitting on like that part. I'm thinking as supports, I can just use two by four. So basically two by fours underneath that to where it doesn't just cave in and I just die as soon as I go off it. And then to build the sides with the actual cut about right like that, I need two of those, one on each side and then have it like that, you know what I'm saying? I'm just use underneath here, there's this big old sheet. I need to rip this out and then draw a line and see if I can't cut it right and then yeah Now it's time to get to building. Alrighty, I just got the first dealio cut. That's going to be the hardest part right there. As you can see, practically flawless deal. Measure once, cut five times, worked like a charm. Now, should be easy. Throw this sucker right on this thing. 
draw a line right there cut the other one throw some two by fours across for support throw that thing on there and then i don't even know all right now the plan these will stand up probably not have it oh something slightly like that two by fours running one at the top one at the bottom and then probably three or four in the middle screw that puppy in hope it doesn't snap if it does i'm probably just gonna do two by fours all the way up but either way should be chilling now i just need to probably do the two by fours at the top and bottom first connect them maybe do one down there i don't know i got a lot so i can just cut them in little i don't know however long that is like foot and a half sections and uh should be good hardest part is out of the way I'm done. Look at this freaking thing. It don't look all that, eh, yeah, it kinda does. I mean, this thing is vertical. Now, all I need to do is shove this deal on it. And hopefully it uh, bends on down and screws in to, I'm thinking, do maybe one, I'm thinking I won't even put any screws on this on this edge here and just do them all straight into the two by fours all the way across and uh if that works this thing's freaking golden okay hasn't broken yet look at that i might put a couple more screws i just gotten one in each two by four all the way down but i mean it's there have it on the dock maybe i'll just throw like i don't know that or maybe just some dirt right there so it's not like kink but i mean that thing's about flawless if you ask me so i'm just gonna sawzall that off sawzall that off and then uh probably those two end pieces and then i mean this thing's Freaking done. Let's take it down to the dock, see what it looks like. <laughs> Boom. This is what it's going to look like. And I'm gonna put a couple screws just straight through here. I mean, this turned out perfect. 
I can just screw it right into the dock so it's nice and sturdy. But uh, yeah, here's the plan. Start way up there at the house. Can't really tell on camera, but that's a pretty darn dead freaking steep hill. If you go down that, you're probably going 20 to 30 miles an hour. Get on here and absolute yeet off here. And I have no idea like how much speed I'm gonna be getting. I don't know if I'm gonna go straight up and then land right there or just launch and land literally over by that stick or if i'm just gonna go straight into a backflip i really have no idea what could happen but then also if you think about it nothing really could go wrong as long as i hit that i mean i'll be fine now do i know if there's not a giant brush pile right 10 inches under the water no but i mean who really cares if i impale myself on a stick i mean It'll be on video, so it'll be fine. Like I said, this is a pretty big little clunk for a uh, bike. So I'm probably, I don't know, just going to throw some dirt right there to where it's nice gradual into this straight vertical wall. So I don't know if I'm going to continue this video and actually like start hitting this thing in this video. It depends on how long it is. I might end it here and then come out tomorrow and hit this. It's Friday afternoon right now. I might come out saturday tomorrow and just absolute send it to the moon yeah depending on how long this video is i'll see you all in the next one or i'll see you tomorrow